Good morning. It is Tuesday, and it is officially my last week as a college student ever. I am very excited, and I feel very weird that I'm not ever going to be, like, going to school again. I might go to school again. I don't know. Just take, like, a few classes. Keep up on my my knowledge of the arts. But officially, I graduate as a graphic designer and now I gotta be an adult. So I figured that I would make a video documenting my last week as a college student and what I am doing throughout it. This might be a long video, this might not, I don't know. I just wanted to make this for me as like a little time capsule so I could look back on it and see what and remember what my last week as a college kid looked like. Today I just have an animation class and I have to go to the gym to get my last um, hours in and I'm testing out. Um, and then Thursday is my actual last day uh, finishing up my animation class. I will try to record things while I'm at school. I don't know because college kids are awkward. I'm going to do my best to record what I can. But right now I'm headed to school and it is a little rainy which makes it a little bit more exciting because rain is amazing. Um, but yes, so I'm on my way and I'll take you with me. I've made it to class. Um, I'm gonna make this quick because there's a lot of people around. <laughs> I'm gonna switch out and use my phone for video because using this camera is gonna be a little bit. I'll take you with me, but I'm going to switch devices. So here we go, last week of college. quite a bit are probably going to be hue saturation and levels. So when I'm colorizing things that are white, uh, there's this hue saturation has an option called colorize. All right? And you'll see that not much happens to the white, okay? So what I'm going to do is I'm going to actually just drop this below. It's a long walk from the art department to the gym, so we will see. This last, um, how this last gym class goes. Officially done with gym twenty nineteen. Spring semester. I am so happy this is over. All right, I am home now from class. I went to the bank. Not focusing. I went to the bank and then I ran to Aldi to get some food for the week. Um, so yeah, I'm just gonna make myself some food and I'm really gross and then I'm gonna shower and I'll be right back. Okay, I'm out of the shower. I probably look like a train wreck because nothing is on my face, but that's okay. Um, right now, I have paper, envelopes, my stickers, and my business cards. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to write thank you letters to three of the professors who have like been the most like influential on my really long community college journey. Um, yeah, so I'm going to write these right now. I'm writing one to Jay, my graphic design teacher. Um, I loved like every moment of his class. I enjoyed so much of what he taught, the techniques, and the projects. It was great. And then I'm also writing one to Lily. Lily is a traditional artist. She's a painter. She taught, at least what I took, she taught color theory, illustration, she taught me um, art history part one. Um, I love Lily to pieces. She is 
amazing like I'm never gonna forget her and she has like left a very lasting impact on me for sure um yeah Lily is just very unique eccentric quirky and I love everything about her she's great and then I'm writing one to Mike and he is currently my animation professor and he is like he's epic like he is very hardcore business like the guy is great. He knows what he's doing. He's been in the business for a long time. He gives solid tips. He's not scared to help you through something like four or five times. He's great. So I'm going to get to writing and I'm going to be watching some YouTube. Okay, so letters are done. Hair is drier. And I am one step closer to graduating. Well, if I don't see you for the rest of the day, I will see you tomorrow get up you lazy butt it's time to make a video you don't want to make a video are you too tired you've only been sleeping for 18 hours good morning all not really good morning good noon time it is Wednesday T minus two or three days depending on how you feel about the situation before I graduate um, today is kind of a busy day. I did a little workout this morning, but I am going to the gym with my mom later. So today I'm just going to be doing some cleaning and running errands. Um, Candace and Stefan are coming over Friday night after graduation to sleep over and hang out for a little bit. Um, I need to clean the spare room so that Stefan can be comfortable in there. And I need to fix our air mattress that has a hole somewhere for Candace. So this is the spare room. It doesn't look super messy, but let me tell you, it was a wreck before I got to it on Monday night or Monday. Yeah, you couldn't even like see the floor in here and like that pile is for Stefan and then that's the mattress that I need to fix. But yeah, so I'm going to try to tidy up in here just a little bit and then try to fix this mattress. the my air pump thing is broken so I might have to blow it up myself I guess or try to inflate it some other way <sighs> this is a bummer um yeah I will come back with some hopefully good news okay I think I have to do this in stages because I'm getting lightheaded from inflating this thing but um okay so my mom is gonna be on her way home in a little bit so that we can go to the gym but before that I figured I could try to make some cookies and making cookies is like a little snack for everyone that's going to graduation because my last name starts with a P and it's gonna take a while to get to me so I figured I'd make them little snacks for while they're waiting if they get hungry or anything before we all go to dinner so let's see if I can do this before my mom gets home I'm not putting M&M's in it yet because the color from the M&M's bleed into the dough. So I think I'm just going to chill this until tomorrow night. And then mix the M&M's in and cook it. Cook all the cookies. I think I'm going to leave you here for today. Got a few more things to do uh, that aren't interesting enough to put in this video. So I'm going to do that. And then I'll see you tomorrow for my last day of college. And I am freaking out and I feel sad and happy and excited and terrified all at the same time. So I will see you with all those emotions tomorrow. Good morning all. Ugh, I woke up at like 5.15. So I'm going to the gym now. But it's the last day of class. Tornadic. Tornadic. How's that for a word? The tornadic possibilities. So, I'm at school, about to go to class. It is my last day of college. I am 
I'm more, I'm very sad. I'm more sad than I thought I would be. I'm just sad because I'm not gonna be here anymore because I love the art department and the atmosphere and I'm like always loving the constant like influences of creativity around me and I'm not gonna get that as much. So I'm kind of sad about that. Also, as you saw, I'm wearing my community college shirt, honorary for the last day of school. Um, I was gonna wear this for graduation, but then I decided I actually wanted to look nice. So I figured I'd just wear this for the last day of school. Someone stole, someone stole my parking spot. I've been parking here for a whole semester and the person stole my spot. Okay, I guess it's an omen to change. That change is inevitable and it is going to happen. So I might as well accept it for what it is and take it with grace. So I am off to my last class ever of school. critique I, I'll tr I think I got a good video of my critique I tried to record my own but oh my gosh I'm done I'm graduating tomorrow and then I found out one of my classmates Patrick is graduating with me so that's great I handed out my letters to my professors I thank them for everything and actually my professor Lily who now goes by Kate um, she's actually gonna be at graduation I'm so happy um, so, yeah, and then she stuck her email on my sleeve of my jacket to keep in touch with me. <laughs> but, um, yeah, this is the end. I am done with school. Wow. Your daughter is done with school. this room for the most part for Stefan. I brought him some blankets and a pillow if he needs anything. He has all my instruments to fiddle with if he needs to. And then I just put this up because I thought it was kind of cool. It's half of a curtain but I think it looks cool. It looks neato. Uh, he has a bunch of books if he wants to read. And then I made up this little area like a trash can, a fan if he needs it. And then I gave him some towels, and then I gave him his little box. I added a few things, like these bow ties that I got for him for a dollar. He already knows that he's getting them. They just came in the mail. And then I gave him one of my soda waters. Speaking of soda water. So this, we got this for my mom for Christmas, but she never used it. Like, she never uses it. So I stole it, and it's a baby refrigerator. Like, it actually works. And so I put 
if it'll open. I put some LaCroix in there for him, a bunch of different flavors, because he loves soda water like me. So, he is set to go. Stefan, I hope you like your room, because I worked really hard on it. But yes, that is all for Stefan's room, thankfully. I thought I would show you my graduation outfit. This is it. It's so pretty. I love all the colors, because this is going to go with my dress. And this sash is actually not like original to, I guess, the school. Um, the sashes that they were selling were like, they cost more than my cap and gown. So I just wanted to hold off on that. And on top of that, I wanted to represent the art department kind of more than the school itself, <laughs> which is kind of funny. But so yeah, so I had my mom, my mom made this for me. It's like, it's a pretty good like version of a sash i like it and then what i did is i cut out a piece of felt in the shape of the pen tool which is the tool that we use when we're um designing things like a photoshop or illustrator and i'm just gonna like put it on stick it on there so yeah i'm gonna represent art majors <laughs> but yeah i also have this necklace which i bought from walmart on sale Stefan actually picked it up for me um, and it's not going on my cap, it's going on like this part, so it's like a headband. Um, but yeah, that's my outfit. I'm also contemplating not wearing heels because it's in the grass and it's, it's been kind of wet over here. It's been like a little rainy and gloomy, so I don't know if I want my heels to sink into the mud if should I decide to wear heels. So I'm contemplating Birkenstocks, but we'll see. So my mom and I went to Costco. And we picked up a cake. She surprised me and told me that we were getting a cake. But we're getting it for tomorrow after dinner. Um, and then we came back. I watched some Jeopardy. And now I'm up here and I'm getting ready for bed. Um, uh, yeah. Tomorrow I will officially be a college alumni. Which is kind of weird to think about. But for now I'm just going to go to bed and rest. Because I'm already starting to get nerves for some reason. But um... Yeah, I'm very excited, and I guess I will see you tomorrow on my last day of prepping before I become a college graduate.